Happy birthday to you. Amanda Beauregard raises balloons each year on February 9th, celebrating the birthday of her husband, Pat, who passed away from colorectal cancer when he was 32 years old. At the time, their son Noah was a newborn. We found out that Pat's cancer metastasized to his brain the night before I had Noah. It's what sent me into labor. Amanda and Pat were just married when his cancer was discovered at age 29. In that same conversation, the fellow that was working that day asked us what our plans for the future were. And we were a month out from our wedding. But thanks to fertility and family planning being part of the conversation from the beginning, as well as the support of social workers at Dana-Farber Cancer Institute, where Pat was treated, Pat and Amanda were able to take the steps that allowed them to have Noah before Pat passed away and for Amanda to have their second son, Colin, years after Pat's death. We say prayers at night and we'll say, you know, um, please watch over everyone that I love and especially those that are sick or struggling or have cancer. Pray, hope, don't worry was the mantra Amanda and Pat lived by, coming to call it Panda Power, short for Pat and Amanda. Panda Power is now an integral part of the Patrick Beauregard Foundation, a nonprofit Amanda started for research and awareness of young onset colorectal cancer. That's when colorectal cancer is diagnosed before the age of 50 and rates are rising. Colorectal cancer is now the leading cause of cancer death in men under the age of 50 and the second among women of the same age. It was a race against time with Pat and in some ways I start to feel like it's a race of, against time with my own kids. Amanda is sharing her story, hoping it helps other patients, helps other spouses and helps other families. She says the support she received at Dana-Farber while Pat was sick is something she wants for everyone dealing with this diagnosis. Getting connected to the social work team through the Young Onset Center, having those resources as part of the center for patients, for caregivers, for other family members, you can't place a value on it.